Today we're at Peyton's Wild and Wacky 10 by 5K. Yes, that's 10 5Ks, one every hour on the hour. And we're off for the first lap. And just like Peyton Moore, this race is wild and wacky with single entries, team entries, and a 5K on lap number four you can sign up for. So now we're on Peyton's Pass and they've painted all the routes white. It's like an obstacle course. Beautiful weather, like perfect weather. It's gonna be a great day. Nice, yeah. So if you've been following on any of my videos, you know I'm gonna meet people in my run. And this is Justin. Hey guys. Justin is law enforcement officer protecting and serving. <laughs> Proud of him what he's doing and hey high quality h2o just gotta have fun on these things gotta find moments to just get you out of the suck and like that run at number one is done uh 24 minute 5k i got 22 minutes to stay warm in the movie so my name's dave moore i'm 52 years old name of that three is old flame this is my uh, fifth year doing Peyton's Run. I ran the very first one, and I talked one of my buddies into coming out here and running this race with me as a two-person relay. And then I got the idea the next year that I was just going to do it all in my gear. And this is just a great race. So yeah, I won't miss this race. You know, I'll you know come out here. I might not be able to run all ten of them forever, but I'll still be out here doing something with this race. And uh, a little hot, but this is a great atmosphere out here. And yes, this race had a great atmosphere. Noah and his wife invited me to come participate in this extraordinary event celebrating the life of their son Peyton. Peyton was a part of the Mount Pleasant Track Club and there is something special about these little runners. All day long I'd be chasing little red shirts like Savannah, this seven year old. And just for the record, this young seven year old kicked my butt. And then I met Whit. Goes on the attack! There you go Whit, come on! Come on Whit! Come on, dig, 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 come on, I'm gonna get you, go, 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 go. My name is Tammy Dennis. I'm with the Mount Pleasant Track Club. Um, Peyton ran for us when he was seven, eight, nine years old and was a strong athlete. He ran the mile for us. He also was a great javelin thriller. His um, passing hit us all very hard. A lot of our kids now never competed with him, but they all know about Peyton. We actually do a Peyton Moore Memorial Athlete of the Year. And then every year we make sure that the kids know about Peyton's legacy, which is really what what today is all about, the celebration of his legacy. Race number three is now underway. Oh my God. This time hopefully it'll be a little slower. And here we go. So on our recovery lap, Justin just said, hey, we it's gonna open up up here, let's turn it off. On our recovery. And that happened almost every lap. There's just something about this event that helps you push deeper, be it the signs and sayings of Peyton encouraging you or the moron village cheering you on on the front stretch. But I set two personal 5K records at this event. This is the combined 50K relay and 5K. As a lot of people, the trail's all warmed up for you. And this lap is everybody, so it's 50Kers teammates, solos. And so the trail was packed, but oh my God, these guys are fast. Would you mind getting the winners of the 5K? Yeah. Look, just look to the back. When they come through, Got it. you can do whatever you do. So these are some of Peyton's childhood friends. And so I thought it'd be cool to hand over the camera and see what they give me. We should have finishers any minute, it's getting intense. <laughs> Yes, we did, and Greg Burkhart took home the victory with a 17.23, and Greg won every 5K with his slowest being a 19.33. He ran 50K in three hours and one minute. We're going to start awards in just a little bit. It's so cool 
cool to see all the amazing companies that come out and support this event, like Fleet Feet, Hoka Shoes. So this is what makes Peyton's Wild and Wacky 10x5K amazing. It's people like John from Greens and Grounds, and, and seriously, they came out and support, had coffee for us this morning. And events like this cannot be pulled off without amazing volunteers. And my hat goes off to Rachel, the volunteer coordinator, for an outstanding job at this event. Seized up a little bit, so hopefully I'm loose to do it. One of the concerns going into this race was all of the downtime, and man, it has caught up with me, and I am in some pain. This is lap eight, and lap eight has hurt, but they say eight is great, and nine is fine, but ten is the end. you that if you feel that push I know my boy will push you through this thank you all for being here and uh, I cannot tell you how much it means to see you guys all doing this and suffering so <laughs> I've had the crap beat out of me, but hey, it is almost over, and that's all that matters. And Bob right here is killing it. Hey, man. Bob and Beth have been a huge motivator for me. They have cheered me on the entire time. I am very grateful, Bob and Beth. All right. This is lap 10, and this is Craze. He is so mentally strong out here running, and just the energy level. Like, if you want to do a race that is outstanding, where you can have energy that will take you to different levels, like suit up in a fire suit and come out and do 50K. It makes this, it fun. This is the race, so kudos, sir. And lap 10 is almost over, and there's Beth cheering me on. Thank you, Beth. Man, this lap was hard. My goal was to come in and do a sub five hour 50K, and that is it. Four hours and 55 minutes. I did it. 10 5K, a 5K every hour on the hour. And like I have said multiple times, this was an amazing event. So these are the many people in the Charleston area who have helped us and continue to help us year after year to raise the money that we raise and make this such a successful event. And these supporters have helped us raise over $50,000 for the Simplify Fund, Mount Pleasant Academy, fitness programs, and Mount Pleasant Track Club. But they have helped us keep the runners first and the spirit of our son alive. And um, that has been just such an amazing thing for us and um, we can't thank them enough. So I would like to thank Noah, Jen, and Miles Moore for allowing me to document Peyton's Wild and Wacky 10x5K. If you would like to be a part of this race, registration opens September the 10th. And if you would like to donate to the Peyton Johnson Moore Fund, there's a link in our bio.